team. First, we would like to acknowledge the VIPs who are on the floor. Uh, that is Athletic Director Clint Rauscher. You're at the platform. Head Coach Paul Stadelman. Assistant Coach Blake Shaw. Assistant Coach John Ramsey. Assistant Coach and also Head Coach for Girls Volleyball, Andy Bozo. Logan, we got the fight. And assistant coach Brandon Miller. We have one senior to acknowledge tonight, and that is Joey Dannon. Number four outside hitter, escorted by Joe and Nicole Dannon. What Joe is most proud of as a member of the Woods Volleyball Program is seeing how the program keeps growing and getting better every year. Joe plans to attend the University of Pittsburgh and study nursing after high school. Joe's advice to underclassmen is the sooner you start seriously putting in the work, both on the court and in the weight room, the sooner you will start to see results in your ability. Joe again. And Take this opportunity to acknowledge the North Allegheny seniors who are with us tonight. Outside hitter number 29, Jax Wilhite. And middle blocker number 34, Maroon Cavetti. Congratulations to all the seniors who are here with us tonight. And that includes you all. Good evening and welcome to Shale Area High School in Gym A for tonight's Boys Volleyball Senior Night between the Shale Area Titans and the North Allegheny Tigers. Hi, I'm Matt Brucker alongside the one and only Mark Povich where tonight we have a clash of the Titans. The best two teams in section play and in the state are going to go, go at it tonight. Mark, what do you got to tell us about the North Allegheny Tigers? Yeah, definitely mad. The, that is, North Allegheny Tigers are going to put up a pretty good game tonight against the short Shaler Area Titans as they're, the Shaler is ranked number one in the state and NA is currently tied for second with Butler. But they are on a, currently on a four game win streak looking to make that five. But Matt, what about, what about the Titans? What do we expect from them tonight? As you mentioned, one of the most highly rated Shaler teams ever. And in this case for volleyball, they're ranked number nine in the country by USA Today. High expectations, so far they've delivered. Undefeated in all games, they have won. And right now they're top of the section, they're seven and zero. Oh. On the backs of Logan Peterson and Cam Miller, their two best players, and of course the senior you met earlier, Joey Gannon. So tonight it's gonna to be a battle that the Titans are hoping to come out on top and all but a depth, but for sure, take the section crown. So we'll see you out for coverage of tonight's game. Can't wait to see you there. Middle blocker, Varun Kaveri. 
in junior, number 51, middle blocker, Theo Wilkinson. Head coach for the Tigers is Dan Long, assisted by Tim Burrish, David Sanfilippo, and Ryan Lundy. Welcome back up in the booth. We are just ready to begin the first set. North Allegheny will serve first. Serving is number 27, Matthew LeMay. Battle for section supremacy begins now. Rosenwald set over. And Peterson gets the first point on the board for the Titans. Yeah, very critical too, the North Allegheny team, the defending state titles champions, as Logan Schimmel will serve. Rosenwald will set, and Palumbo drops the hammer, and the Titans are up early 2-0. The Titans lost these guys back in the state quarterfinals. Got revenge though earlier in the season. The Schumann will serve here. And the spike just outside there. Gartner tried to see if he could slide it inside, but the line judge said it was just out. Schimmel serving for the third time here. Sent it over. The spike and no one's home. Gartner able to redeem himself and score North Allegheny's first point of the game. So Titans looking for the season sweep. That last win was the first time in 15 years the Titans were able to beat the Tigers, who have always been a perennial powerhouse. A nice job there by Peterson, able to bank it off the North Allegheny defender. Titans up 4-1 here early. As you mentioned in the pregame, Mark, Titans are undefeated. North Allegheny Tigers, they are riding a four-game win streak. As is served by Peterson, coming a tough return. Rennell with the plans. And then by Werzer, Tigers miraculously able to keep it alive, and they'll send it back over to Cam Miller. Plans a spike, and now send it through Palumbo. That's his second kill of the day. 
huge play there by Jax Willwhite from the NA Tigers to be able to keep that one in, a one-handed swing to get it back to his teammate over, hit it over the net. Unable to not be able to score the point though. Electric beginning for the Titans. Student section, a lot of them seniors, really excited to see their guy, Joey Gannon, play. As that'll be an ace for Peterson. And you think, Mark, a team like this, you got 12 juniors on the Titans roster. North Allegheny, they have two seniors. And the, and the Titans have their own lone senior. So next year, it's going to be a repeat matchup between these two again, basically the same teams as Peterson serves as in the net. Yeah, a surprising amount of juniors on both teams will put forth a good season next year as of this one. Yeah, these guys who are experienced, especially on the Shaler side, as this will be Gartner serving. Jump serve, it by Peterson over to Palumbo, and no one's home for the Tigers. And Shaler's able to regain that five point lead, up seven to two now. Early in the first set as Gartner will be subbed off for North Allegheny. And checking in the game for the Titans is Joey Gannon, to the delight of the student section. As Zach Werzer will serve now for the Titans. Good nicely the shot over and the spike partially deflected. Werzer will send it over to Peterson trying to drive it home and will accidentally place. Hit the back white line. As Peterson showing off his hitting ability early. These Titans are doing a very nice job of hitting the outside corners on the, the court as the North Allegheny defenders are sitting right in the middle. Yeah, not giving much of a chance early. Where's the service fielded? The hit be poked over. Plans gonna try to knock it over, and he's able to win that one there. Titans up nine to two, and now timeout, North Allegheny. Titans definitely sending some shock into the Tigers. Up a seven point lead very early in this game. And I was able to talk to Coach Stadelman before this game, and they always say it, North Allegheny is the one we have to beat. This year, especially the case, they're trying to win the section. And right now they have come out electric, they've come out on fire. And they've really come to play. North Allegheny's got to match that intensity or else they're going to get run over here in this first set. Yeah, definitely a very intense game from both the number one and two seeded team in the Whippeo right now. So exactly what Coach Stanman's saying right now, just to make sure everything's right and keep the momentum going. As the Titans will serve coming out of this timeout. First to 25, win by two. Titans are up by a score of nine to two. Where's her to serve? Third field by the libero over in the spike, rejected. Somehow saved, and the play will continue on. And Gannon scores his first point of the night, up over two North Allegheny defenders. These Titans are doing a good job of hitting it pretty far deep in the court, and then having their deep that North Allegheny defense move back and then hit it right in the middle zone. Yeah, that was a good dig there by Cavetti, able to save that one. I for sure thought that was going to be a point as Wurza will serve again, and that time he won't be as fortunate as that will hit the net. Yeah, it looked like the Titans' first error really of the game. They played phenomenal here to start off. They're up 10 to three. As this is Gartner serving. Sorry, Robertson, tip, tip over. Fielded, looking for the spike, rejected by Palumbo and Plans. Gonna try again. Miller's able to block that plan, shove Palumbo out of the way. Werzer hits the net again, and North Allegheny's got back-to-back -back points. Robertson, the freshman outside hitter. He's ready to go again, served in, fielded by Peterson. Plans, get in with the hit, and that will be in. Titans definitely using the height to his advantage as they're able to get up high and able to use a lot of power when hitting the ball over the net. That ball was set perfectly and Gannon took full advantage of that. There was no way that was being stopped. 
Nice and floater by Miller was able to get the NA Tigers to mess up on that serve. Yeah, they double hit on that one. As Titans now up 12 to 4 in this first set, Miller will serve it. Over Cavetti, the spike, and he's able to hit it in there. He's one of their taller guys as he will be subbed out. Now North Allegheny's libero, number four, Will Hahn. Will serve it for the Tigers. Wurzer will bump it with the plans. And Gannon, that one was a little high. And that will be out 12-6 now to score. Titans with a still a six point lead. You couldn't ask for a better start to this game for senior night 2023. On will serve it. Peterson up into the air over the plans. Gannon is going to be rejected by two North Allegheny Tigers. Gannon will try again, deflected up in the air. They're able to keep it. It's going to be poked through and no one home. Jax White able to send it in for the Tigers. Now they have some momentum here taking the last few points. Long gets it over, floats it. Plans Wurzer from the back line, is able to send it in. Over, and that's going to be rejected by Gannon and Schimmel. Trying again, and that one is just over the hands of Gannon. And as Tigers clawing their way back into this one, 12 to 8. Hahn will serve for his fourth time here. Wurz will send over the plans, finding Gannon. Well, we felt well. Robertson will send it over. Plans. And that's going to be Logan Schimmel getting in for the kill for the Titans. Tigers trying to close the lead Titans had with the Titans regain possession, trying to extend it once again. Yeah, Tigers make good use of that timeout. Let's see, here's his Zach Rosenwald serve. Logan, and that's going to bounce off of Schimmel and Peterson. As White's able to get the point for the Tigers. Carioto will serve for the Tigers now. His guys are down 13 to 9, and he's going to hit that one straight into the net and give the Titans a freebie and the serve. Gann will check out now for Donovan Rennell, who will serve. Floats it in. Hahn. Sent it over to hit. And Miller wasn't able to feel that one. And look, look out, Bench. That one hit with standing varsity players. Gartner was able to deliver that one home. Now, just like that, back to a four-point game. Titans up 14 to 10. As LeMay is back to serve for the Tigers. Dig there by Miller. And that one's going to be a double. Jim couldn't quite get that one. As LeMay will serve it here again for the Tigers. Big jump serve, and that time he didn't get enough on it. That will hit into the net. Tigers have definitely started playing better. Uh, but they've shot themselves in the foot a couple of times as they've served a couple in the net. Logan Schimmel will serve it now for the Titans. Almost set it. And rejected by Dante Palumbo. Sixteen eleven now the score. Schimmel to serve again. Blocked once again, Palumbo and Peterson combining for that block. Titans now got three in a row. Dimmel to walk it in. Over to Gartner, and he's able to deflect it off Werzer. 
and make this a five point game. 17 to 12 in favor of the Titans. They've led wire to wire so far in this one. Now up to serve is Ryan Quatman. Hook that over to Werzer. Back over to Peterson, he'll slam it home. It's a huge uh, over the back serve there. A little sub now, plans will check back in for Rosenwald. Logan Peterson, probably the Titans best outside hitter, was last week's Trip Total Media section player of the week. He'll send it in. For Robertson, the spike no good. Not to regroup. Hahn will send it over, can't spike it as he's the libero. And Plans couldn't get it up high enough in the air for Palumbo to spike it. And that'll give the serve back over to the Tigers. Stone Gartner to serve. Send it into Rennell. Plans, back over to Palumbo. He had to reach for it. Hahn will save it. And it's still alive. Rennell. Plan sets Palumbo, and that was a little wide. Yeah. Palumbo and Plans have been a pretty deadly duo so far this game with their offense and defense. A couple of nice blocks to get them probably around five, six points. And a couple of nice spikes. Plans can do it all. You saw him in the basketball game against Penn Hills. Multi-sport athlete as Wurzer will send it over. Robertson the spike, and he's able to beat Wurzer there. And now this is the closest the Tigers have gotten it since it was 3-0 as the Titans put up a 9-2 lead early on. And the Tigers have come back as now Shayla will take a timeout as they are seven points away from taking the first set. Tigers on the prowl. So back and forth early the start here, Mark. Titans had an outstanding start, 9-2 run. And the Tigers start the counter as they've gone on a 13-9 run since. Yeah, definitely, Matt. I think their, uh, their timeout early on definitely woke them up as they, they were able to close the gap by a lot now at making it 18 to 15. Hopefully the Titans are looking to do the same and hopefully close out this first match. So on that four, uh, four straight win streak for the Tigers, they did not, not have to face a team with a winning record. But to be the best, you have to beat the best. And that's what the Titans are now. Gartner will serve for the Tigers. Strong serve fielded by Miller. Plans will set Palumbo, and he didn't get on it at all. And North Allegheny brings it within two. Gartner will jump serve it again. Fielded by Rennell. Plans with a set Werzer. Back over Robertson, and that'll be deflected out of play by Plans. And North Allegheny has brought it back to one now. We were talking during our warm ups, and we were thinking this was going to be a back and forth affair. So far, it has yet to disappoint us early in this first set. Where is their diving save? Rennell's just going to have to punch it over. Hahn's going to poke it, but could not find the floor. Nice read by Miller there for the Titans as he was able to let that one drop out of bounds. Crucial point for the Titans now. They will have the serve. Werzer will be back at it. Jump third, fielded. Over to Robertson. He's gonna try to set Gannon, that's rejected. Gannon will try again. Tipped up in the air, Hahn. Lands over to Miller, who will set Gannon. Trying to poke it over, it'll be saved by Robertson. And of course, just to hit it over, but. Well, that point puts the Titans at just Five points away from winning their first set as they still have to serve. 2017 timeout North Allegheny.
trying to prevent the Titans from getting any momentum. 2017, our score just in the first set. It will be their last time out of the set. Probably the right time to use it too. As you're hoping to try to stop that run. The Titans have a timeout in their back pocket if they feel the need to use it. And ideally, you'd, they'd probably want to serve this out, but also ideally you try to win every point, so. Yeah, Titans definitely regrouped after that last timeout, bringing the score up to 20 to 17 as they will have to serve. Yeah, North Allegheny was plus one since that timeout. Tigers brought all the way back to Juan Shaler on a, a 2-0 run here. Wurzer to serve it. Fielded by Farr. Poked over by Robertson. Land's gonna try to go to Peterson. And that was not fielded well by Farr at all. Titans now up to 21. Gardner will check back in for the Tigers, replacing Farr. Hey, that's up two, 34, 14. Hey, Dante, 34 Fourth time serving now in a row for Wurzer. Hoping to keep the streak alive over the Hahn. Pulled over to Robertson, and it was just out. Close there, Robertson thought he had it. But the official was right there on the corner, saw that one clearly. Titans now up 22 to 17 here in this first set. Trying to send it over, Plans will deflect it over to Peterson, and again, wasn't quite over to hit it over. Tigers will happily take that point. Will Robertson to serve for the Tigers. Pearson will take it. Gannon, and he's gonna slam it. Joey Gannon with the kill. On his senior night. Nice play here is now a libero. Cam Miller will serve. On, big spike denied by Gannon and Schimmel. Pavetti thought he could get over him. Gannon said, no way, Jose. Miller sends it over. Looking for the spike. They will keep themselves alive. That was set point. Tigers will need to convert five in a row to avoid going down one to nothing. And they'll have to rely on their libero server to do it. Wurzer, plans will flick it over, saved by Hahn. And unable to finish the job is White. And the Titans, number one in the state, take a one nothing lead here at the end of the first set. So nice to see here for the Titans, winning that set 25 to 19. As any momentum attempted by the Tigers was foiled do excellent defensive work, in my mind, by Peyton Plans. Key piece of that team in the center. He's the, their setter. Primarily, when he's out again, the they have to change it up. And he's that facilitator, like a point guard in basketball. He's the guy that sets up the play for the shooters and the hitters to do their jobs. Yeah, another one that stood out to me was Palumbo, as he was able to get a lot of hits over the net, a lot of kills and able to work with plans on a lot of blocks and uh, scoring at least half their points in the set. And Peterson had five kills in that first set, coming up with a fifth of their total points. As, as we mentioned before, he's their guy. If they're in trouble, if they need someone to get a good spike, he's, they're gonna look to him. Gannon had a few good ones as well. palumbo has been a key guy for them. All these guys were able to, to hit it over. 
as Coach Suman will talk here. He's got to be satisfied with the way they've played. North Allegheny coach, not so much. As he's going to be digging into him a little bit. But they've had some strong performances on their side. Stone Gardner, that's a good name. He's been their lead over, he's been their leading scorer. But Robertson's contributed as well. Those have been their top two guys. And of course the intimidating presence of Cavini. Sorry, Cavetti. He's their big presence in the middle, number 34. He's not out there to start. As Coach Stamen will finish bringing it down. We've got a minute to go before we resume. As we start the second set. Best of five here. We play here for the boys. As they'll finish breaking it down. Now, keep in mind how big of a game this is. It's just North Allegheny's dominance over Shaler for the past decade and a half. And pretty much over the rest of the section. Winning 14 out of the last 15 section titles. If the Shaler were able to win it, this would be a monumental year, let alone they're undefeated, hoping to keep that run alive. Yeah, definitely. Now that, that um, they, the Titans pulled out that first win in the set, that brings their total up to 45 out of 49 total sets won this set, this year. And that's just complete dominance, too. They're not barely winning this game. They have yet, the team has yet to take them to the fifth set all year long. As the Titans will have to serve to start, Logan Schimmel will do so. We're underway for set number two. And that one is out. Smart play there by Robertson to let it go. First time this game, the, the Tigers have had the lead over the Titans. Looking to extend it here. Yeah, for sure. This is number 27, Matthew LeMay. Serve for the Tigers, and he will do them a favor as he sends it into the net. In a game that's going to be as close as this, mistakes like that might cost you in the end. You've got to be aggressive against such strong defenses. As Peterson will serve here for the Titans. And says, if you can do that, I can do that as well. He serves into the net, and now the Tigers will substitute. They'll bring in Plotman. He will serve it. And three straight serves in Lynette. We'll start off the second set of play. Probably the last time we'll see that. That'll bring up Wurzer. He led a couple of good runs for the Titans back in the first set. Probably looking for a float here just to get it over the net and that should get it into play. Set it in. Spike, that will be fielded and sent back over Hahn. Going to set Gartner, and he hit that one out. Had the whole lane open, just hit it too hard and too wide. As the Titans now have the lead, three to two in the second set. Wurzer with the serve. Set for Cavetti. Hooked up in the air by Palumbo. Those the plans. Gannon off, bounces it off Cavetti. To the delay of that student section on their feet now. Three o run for the Titans. Wurzer will serve. Down low, fielded by Robertson. Looking for Cavetti and Plans will poke it over, but just out of play. And as the score is now four to three. Titans still with the advantage. Gartner will serve. Fielded by Peterson. Over to Palumbo. Set down by Cavetti. Over to Gannon now. Cavetti with another block. He worked himself from the left to the right with two outstanding blocks. 
to even the game up at four apiece here early in the second set. Gardner will serve. Peterson's going to hit it over. Couldn't quite keep that on the Titans side, and Cavetti will spike it. Yeah, Cavetti definitely using his height to his advantage there as he is able to place it very well. Yeah, it looked like he barely even jumped on that one. 3 0 run for the Tigers. Peterson again unable to control it. Going to set Robertson. They stretch their advantage out six to four now for the Tigers. Gardner to serve once again. Miller is able to keep it in play. Finds plans and that will find its way home. Yeah, Gardner continuing to be a thorn in the Titans side as he will be subbed out now. Now bring in Kinsler for the uh, Tigers. As Cam Miller will send it over. Fielded by Hahn. Has set Robertson, now deflect off Gannon and out of play. North Allegheny up seven to five. Robertson will float it over. And fake the set and spiked it anyway. And a nice work there by Plans as he'll be subbed out. Receiving kudos from the bench. Both Cavetti and Plans able to use their height to their advantage and just tip it over and put it in the pretty good spots, able to score. Especially, too, that's the first time Plans tried that as Rosenwald will serve. Over, got high up the air. It was white, but he was errant with the hit. And now we'll tie things up here, 7-7. Seven, seven. Set over the white, and he's able to find a hole in the Titan defense. And the Tigers now have the lead. Hahn will serve it now for the Tigers. Float it in, miscommunication. As two Titans hit that one. That'll be blocked, play will continue. Peterson will be denied and Rosenwald wasn't able to get it. Diving effort by Gannon failed too. As the Tigers will stretch their lead out nine to seven. Served by Hahn, and smart move there by Werzer to let that one go. And as the Titans bring it back within one, again will check out, Rennell will check in. And he will serve. Floats it in. Able to deflect it up in the air, and Werzer's able to get it. And that will be a point as it didn't matter what he did with that one as the Tigers hit the net. Ties it up 9-9 nine, nine apiece. Back and forth in the second set. And that will float it over and Kinsler wasn't able to pass that one properly. And back and forth we go. Titans now have the lead 10-9. Rennell. Then Robertson up in the air, gonna set White. Denied by Peterson, but that was out of play. And we'll even things up at 10 now. Carriotto to serve it for the Tigers. Float in, Rennell will field it. Goes in walled. Peterson, they'll deflect. Gardner able to get a piece of it. Back over the white. 
tips it over. Rosenwald, Peterson, no good. Garner's gonna give it a try, and that one is out. Gives the Tigers the lead again. A lot of, as we said, this entire game, a lot of back and forth. Shaler up 11-10. Shimon with the serve. Floats it in, Hahn up in the air. Gardner with the spike is able to find the gap between Shimon and Linnell. And he even up at 11 once more. I think we started at 9-9 mark. So the North Allegate game took a point, Shaler took a point. North Allegate game took a point, Shaler took a point. LeMay for North Allegate, and he's hoping to change it. Float it in, Rennell. Rosenwald over to Peterson, and unable to field it there is Kirioto. And Peterson will go serve. Shaler up now 12 to 11. Peterson's also one of Shaler's best servers as Rosenwald will check out. Jump serve, Peterson. In. Garner to hit. Rennell's not able to get it. Tigers tie it up once more. Watman will serve it. Plans gonna set Wurzel, tip it over. Fielded by Quatman. White gonna slam that one in the net. And the Titans regain the lead. Back and forth we go, and either team able to break away from the other. As now it's back to Wurzer to serve. Looks it over. Robertson looking for you know, get Hahn. Plans will set. Play and that's saved by Plans. Gann will spike it over deep and pinpoint accuracy on that hit. As the Titans get that point. You can't get a cleaner kill there. Pretty looking ball too. Sailed right over the North Allegheny defenders. Titans up 13 to 12. As we're going to check here, looks like we have a serving or scoring issue or substitution looks like here. And it looks like a problem with North Allegheny's side. Uh, it looks like an error on the scoreboard. You heard the official, they forgot to award a point to Shaler. I'll make it 14 to 12. Where's her to serve? It's a delayed hit there. Really got the caught the Titans defenders off guard. Yeah, that's one thing too. Learning to jump, how high you need to jump, all those things. These two teams are excellent at figuring out what's the right time is to jump to try to block shots. And speaking of that jump, Gardner's gonna send it into the net. Titans up by two, 15 to 13. Miller with the serve. Good by Robertson. Carioto on the run. Robertson again. Gann's able to get a piece of it. Back to Schimmel. We'll just have to pass it over. Set to Robertson the spike. Deflected by Peterson. Schimmel over to Gannon. Gardner's able to hit that. Gannon gets a piece of it and goes underneath the net. Tigers get that point. Cut the deficit to one. Pretty crazy second set here as compared to the first one. Titans had a huge lead. Tigers definitely made sure not to have that happen again this set. Exactly right, a game of runs is... And in the flex it all around. Plans fakes it. Diving effort by Hahn. Gardner over. Peterson able to get... Save Peterson, can he get it over? No. 
An the amazing tight. effort there by the Titans defense, but just not able to get it over the net. A couple good dives by Hahn as well to keep it in play. Tied up 15-15. First half was first set was a, was a set of runs. This one has been wire to wire throughout. Plans deflected off a of, that off Carioto. And as the Titans regain the advantage, 16 to 15 now, as Plans will be subbed out. Rosenwald will be subbed in, as he will serve. Floats it over, Han. Carioto will set Cavetti. Rejected by Gannon. First time getting a block there for Gannon that resulted in points. Well done. Rosenwald. Will be set over. Schimmel with drops the hammer. 18 to 15, Titans on a run. And just like that, timeout, North Allegheny. Definitely need that timeout there as they were going back from nine to 10 to 10 to 11 11, and then Titans finally broke free and out of a three point lead. It was a pretty wise there timeout. Right, as we take a look over at the student section, you can see it's jersey theme tonight. Great showing here. A lot of those guys are seniors. They only have one in this game, but they're cheering heart and soul for their man, Joey Gannon. It's number four on the court, but number one in your hearts. Eighteen to fifteen. Titans will have the serve as they resume. Trying to keep that momentum alive that they sustained here, going on a 3-0 run. As Rosenwald will serve. Now skip over the net. Set deflect up in the air. And we'll continue. White will try again and he'll get through. A much needed point there for North Allegheny. And they'll sub on their end. Ron will serve now for the Tigers. Floats it in. Peterson over to Rosenwald. Schimmel. And that's parried out of play. Titans up 19-16. As Gann will sub out. Number 47, Donovan Rennell will serve now for the Titans. Floats it over. Carriotto to set to White. Miller was able to get a piece of that, but not able to keep it in play as the Tigers strike back. Carioto now to serve. All the Titans on their le left side, they must have done some scouting as that will be hit twice, but it didn't matter at the end. Titans able to maintain that three-point cushion. Trying to see if they can slowly break away at the end of the second set. Jim will play it in, Han. Up in the air, Carioto will set White. Who Hits that one just long. Titans widen the gap to four now. Last time these two teams played, Shayla was able to take the first set. North Allegheny countered. It would be huge for them to take a 2-0 advantage. That one deflects off of Palumbo's face and in the ground. And much needed once again now. Tigers trying to stay in the second set. LeMay will serve. Close it in, Rennell. Throws them all to set Peterson, rips it. Carriero's gonna send it over to Hahn. LeMay trying to keep it in, they do. 
Rosenwald. Peterson will just float it over Han, diving effort. Garner will spike it in that time. He was able to find the target. 21-19, Titans. A lot of good kills on both sides of the net here. Able to hit those back corners just where they're no man's land. And they're, all, they're almost perfectly in the corners. You can't get any closer than that. LeMay with the serve. Now, Werzer hits the net, deflects off the upper. Now Senator Peterson wasn't able to field it there. One point game now. Stateman will have a word with the official, probably about the fact that hit the upper part. And he will call a timeout. Titans still have that one point advantage. Although North Allegheny will have the serve. So, a couple of small runs here. Titans were able to pull out a four point lead. And then now North Allegheny is able to pull that back now to one. Um, what would you think here will be the Shaler's path of success here for the rest of this set? They definitely be getting a lot. They've definitely done a lot better on defense now, which has given them the advantage to be able to go off on offense. So if you're able to uh, counter the, the spikes, get them up in the air, and then get a... They've had a nice couple tip-overs that have got right in the middle of their defense. That's really scored the Titans a lot of points in the second set, so I think that's their key to winning this second set. Yeah, year after year, North Allegheny is able to produce these talents as they do have the size advantage, averaging about an inch or two over Shaler. It hasn't seemed to matter thus far. LeMay will serve it in for Anna. Brunel, those will set, whereas they're trying to poke it over. Here there, Carioto over to Robertson. Be blocked away. Trying to keep it alive, they do. No touch there. Point will be awarded to Shaler. Much of this may of the North Allegheny coach. I think he was probably trying to say that Shaler touched the net. The head official on the pedestal over there said no. Carrieto's gonna talk to him about it. He's probably not gonna get anywhere though. Three points away from 25. Titans up 22 to 20. Peterson hit that one a little too late. And not what you wanna do. A lot of situation. A lot of net hits this set as the first five points. Oh, excuse me. The first point was a clean serve, but the first four other serves were hit into the net. Okay, right. Four out of the first five plans. Wurzer will calmly send it over. Over to Cavetti, able to keep it in play. Wurzer will send it back to Peterson. Can't spike it there. Over Gardner is denied by the tandem of Werzer and Palumbo. Titans 23 to 21. Hope to serve it out. North Allegheny will likely call a timeout if the Titans manage to score here. Werzer on the serve. Down low. Perfect placement there. And it's set point now for the Titans. Timeout, North Allegheny. It's a huge point here for the Titans. They are able, they're able to put this match away. Give them the 25 to 21. The NA has came back from a larger lead than this, though. Coming back, I mean, to believe, seven points in the first set. Yeah, they were able to do that. The difference there is that at the same time here, it was 24 to, to uh, 19. And now it's 24 to 21, easier chance of doing it. And they need to get three in a row here to even it up at 24 apiece to keep the set moving. 
Definitely still not out of this one yet. So yeah, Titans have three chances to score here and take a huge 2-0 lead. Wurzel will serve for Shaler. Sends it in. Robertson, and that will hit the deck. And the Shaler area Titans have a 2-0 set lead over North Allegheny as they win this one 25 to 21. But well done here by the Titans. Able to keep the Tigers at bay, run away with this one. Uh, what do you think of that set, Mark? I think it was definitely a lot more energy than there was in the first one. There was not as big as a score differential though as the first one. There was a lot more of a gap in the, I think it was an eight point lead that the Titans had over the Tigers. This one I think they only got to about six as they were able to keep each other on their toes the entire time going back and forth. But the third set, they're really looking forward to putting everything left on that they have on the court. See group in the middle now. That's Wurzer, Peterson, Schimmel, and Rosenwald as we're ready to begin this third set. Titans, after two strong performances in the opening two sets, and find themselves up two to nothing. So if they can take one of these final three sets, they will emerge victorious and secure the season sweep over the perennial state title contenders, North Allegheny. LeMay will begin serve as the service goes back to the Tigers to open up this third set. Jump serve. Miller set Rosenwald. And look at that Schimmel, that play there. You saw he was able just to hang in the air for a little bit before delivering the knockout blow. North Allegheny will sub. White checking in the game for LeMay. Schimmel will serve it for Shaler. Robertson not able to field it cleanly. Hans able to get over to White, who just manages to get it over. Brunel, Palumbo, off of Carioto. Titans, two quick points here to start out the third set. Logan Schimmel will serve. On to Carioto. Back to Robertson. Schimmel. Rosenwald tried to save it and couldn't get that one inside that red pole. And that will be a point for the Tigers. Yeah, you could do that shot in tennis, but not in volleyball. As this is Quatman now to serve for the Tigers. Low serve, killed by Rennell to Rosenwald. Pearson will tip it over, sent over at Rennell. Colombo, and that will be set back down by Cavetti. And the Tigers tie it up at two apiece. Gardner will serve now. Sends it over to Rennell. Diving out by Rosenwald. And Brunel will just have to send it over. Set Gartner. And we have a stoppage here, and that'll be a point awarded for Shaler. Might have been a carry there. As their coach once again talking to the official. Probably not getting anywhere with that. Peterson will serve it now. Carioto to set Robertson, who 
Aaron Lee hits that, and the Titans open up the lead back up to two. Lead 4-2 early on in the third set. Pearson will serve, and Tigers didn't think that was going in. You could tell by the way after he reacted that Peterson knew that was going in. With a premature fist bump. Perfect serve there. As he'll be back at it again. Titans up 5-2. to two. Kirioto over to Robertson. And that will sail through everybody. Titans have four in a row. Pearson will serve fifth straight time. That's the man you want taking the serve, Carioto. White's gonna have to hit it from the back. Miller will field it. Pearson deflected. Gartner will be stopped by Zach Werzer, number six on your screen. Titans with a huge five point lead here. Yeah, Titans on a 5-0 run. Looking to hopefully close the set out early. Still got a long way to go, though. Serves in. Hahn. Carioto. Cavetti will one hand it. Had to reach a little bit far back to get it. Well, he's able to deliver the kill. Gartner had to get assist on that last one. Will serve for North Allegheny. And great awareness there by Miller. They've had that an awareness throughout this entire game. I think that's the fourth time they've been able to spot out of bounds. Yeah, I think there was only one time they made an incorrect prediction. And this is the third set, so that's pretty impressive. Where is it? We'll serve it in. Gary Yoto. And he will be stopped. Farr wasn't getting through with that one. He was he met with a wall. The Tigers are unable to make a kill in this set. Titans defense is very strong. Gains them a seven point lead now, making the total nine to three Titans. Wurzer hits it over, far. And Colombo wound up and he spiked that ball. And similar to the first set, Titans find themselves up big early. 10 to three, your score. Where's her up at it again? On will receive the Cavetti. Diving effort by Miller. Keeps it alive. Carriotto gonna set Cavetti. That one is just out again. Tigers looked a little bit off, especially on this set. And now they've got to take a timeout and regroup. So they're down 11 to three. Yeah, man, I've noticed the Titans defense has been very strong this, this set as they've been able to stuff a lot of the Tigers serves, or excuse me, spikes. And that's really giving them a huge lead here. And yeah, exactly. And you'd like to think that since a lot of theirs have been just out, and it, that they've been, Titans have been able to just get to them. As they hit multiple times, they got as many blocks as they do as North Allegheny does points so far in this third set. <laughs> Titans break the huddle. And Wurza will serve up 11-3. Sends it in. Carioto over to Cavetti. Miller's able to parry, keep it in play. And Gannon just over top of Cavetti and Carioto. As I've been saying all night, Matt, these Titans have been deadly with their tip overs. Whether it's Gannon or Plans or Palumbo, they're, they're Peterson, they are all just. 
Warriors will send in deflected. Gartner with the Robertson will poke it over. Peterson finds plans and he will be stopped by the net. And that was the first mistake in this set. Robertson will serve now for North Allegheny. Tigers finally get the ball back, trying to close that gap. Floats it over, Peterson. Plans over to Gannon, and he hit that one wide. Two in a row now for North Allegheny. Good awareness there by the Tigers, let that one go out of bounds. Lumbo with a spike. Gardner's able to get a hand to it, but nothing else. Titans strike back. Up now 13 to 5 in this third set. Trying to sweep the Tigers. Miller. On. White. And they're long once again. Miller will gladly take that though. Sends over to Hahn. Arioto over the white. And the net says no. Titans open up their largest lead of any set, 15 to five. Tigers have not been able to find their stride. Miller. White. Robinson back to Miller. And he is denied by the tandem of Lands and Schimmel. Everything going to Titans way and the North Allegheny is forced to use their second timeout. Huge at this juncture is, if it, is they have to start mounting a comeback. The biggest lead we've seen all night, 11 points for the Titans over the, the, ti the Tigers. And yeah, the largest lead for North Allegheny has only been three. Three or four, I mean, they have not been able to sustain runs when the Titans haven't been able to sustain runs. Yeah, it's definitely very impressive to be able to get a lead this high on a team that is second in the Whippeo as you are the first. Yeah, and you look here, unfazed completely the Titans. They know how to win as they have done so all year long, looking for their eighth win on the season. 8-0 overall, they're trying to get. Them and softball, the only undefeated teams left for Shaler. Both have had amazing seasons. Miller will false start, sends it over. Robertson will send it over. Gannon will take advantage of that as Gardner will kicks the ball in frustration. It's been that kind of set for North Allegheny. Titans have only gotten stronger as this game's wore on. Miller sends it over Robertson. Tipped over Cavetti. Deflected Pearson, able to keep it in. Great work there to keep it in play. Hahn. Spike by White. Denied again. Hahn. A third try for White. And he hits the pole. Titans on the mark. Field of energy in Jim A. Miller. Plans to Gannon. Carioto, Cavetti's just going to poke it over. Miller's able to get there. Plans. A little bit behind. Peterson still managed to get a good one over. White again, stuffed, but out of play. As they've had his number the last few times. That time they had it again but weren't able to deflect it in play. Arm will serve a long time since North Allegheny's had a serve here. Where's her over to plants? Cannon, deflected, Hahn. Over to White. And he's able to send it through everybody. He's either been met with a wall or he's hit it over everything. Titans have got in his head for sure as plans will sub out. 
Rosenwald checks back into the game. That's their, there's two setters. They've both been critical to the Titans' success. Rosenwald will tip over. Miller. Peterson the drive. Over now, Gartner will be stuffed by Gannon and Schimmel. Titans open up a 14 point lead, up 20 to 6. Titans need five more points to put the Tigers out of this match. Tigers cannot regroup with the timeout. They've used both of them already. Rosenwald. Flex over the net again. Denied. Over. Tip. And White's finally able to get a point in for him. Another one of those tip overs that we've been seeing all night here. Able to hit it right in the middle of the defense. Served by Carioto, Rosenwald. Over to Schimmel, and he is stuffed by Jeremiah Satcho. Number zero on your screen. Two points in succession. Able to break the long streak of momentum the Titans sustained. Well, not able to do it any further. Four more points for the Titans. Gannon gets ready to send this one over. Hoping to make that three. Gannon with the Han. Carioto over to Gartner. Stuffed by Peterson. Again, your senior, Joey Gannon, ready to send this one over. How fitting would this be, right, for him to serve it out? Carioto. Well, unfortunately, that would not be the case. White's able to slide it through two Titans defenders. Now bring up Coca to serve. Miller over to Rosenwald. Wurzer will be stuffed, but that one is going to fall outside the white line. The Titans just two points away from shutting out the NA Tigers. And you can see the defeat in their eyes. They've shut, subbed out nearly all of their varsity players. Schimmel sends it in. Rosenwald now. Schimmel. Wurzer? No. Deflected. Robinson able to tip it over. On the back line, Gannon slips it over, and that was hit twice. Titans one point away from shutting out the NA Tigers. The crowd is on its feet. Logan Schimmel for the Titans, ready to send this one over. Set point, Schimmel. Match point for the Titans. Robertson over to Gannon, up in the air, nearly hitting the basketball hoop. Where is it a spike? Could be over Schimmel. So over Wurz is able to punch it over to Hahn. Back over the spike. And North Allegheny will stay alive. They need 14 in a row. And to try to do it is Ryan Quatman. Down 24-10, Gannon with the Rosenwald. Peterson, no, kept alive. Plotman will hit it over. Miller over the Rosenwald. Colombo! And they have done it. Your Shale Area Titans have knocked off the North Allegheny Tigers. 3-0 sweeping. Finishing this last set in dominating fashion, 25 to 10. As the student section for the Titans cheered Joey Gannon's name, as it will close out at Senior Night 2023 for a win. And for the first time in 15 years, the Titans defeat the Tigers on home court. As we'll take you now to our post game, Mark. <laughs> What a performance. Honestly, you can't get much better than that. Having a pretty big lead in both the first and third set. And let's break down the scores. 
First set, Titans victorious, 25-19. Second set, Titans again, 25-21. This third set, absolutely destroying the Tigers, 25-10. And it was a combination of everything, Mark. It was, you talked about a lot about their defense, but I think even more critical was their ability to hammer balls home and get the kills they needed to win. Peterson led the charge in that department. Palumbo was able to deliver the last blow to knock out the Tigers. And we were talking, we said this one was going to be back and forth, four sets, five sets. Titans say, no way, we're taking that chance. They, they sweep in three. As great work there by Joey Gannon. Saw the crowd really supporting him, especially towards the end there when he was serving. And that's got to be a delight to the head coach. Walking in the locker room, Coach Stadelman quietly becoming one of the best coaches in Shaler history. He took the girls to the semifinals last year of the state title. Might be heading there again with this team. So any final thoughts from you, Mark? I just thought it was an amazing game here for the Titans as they were able to win out senior night. It's always a good day. Always you can win a game, especially on senior night. But overall, you can't really get much better than how the Titans played tonight. Yeah, winning that this game against your greatest rival. Nothing better than that. So that will close things out here. Thanks to our cameraman, Mr. Miller. Mark Povich with color commentary. I'm Matt Brucker. Good night here from Shaley area. Titans victorious as they sweep the Tigers.